Since narcissists have anger management issues, they can be very dangerous to know other people. In addition, they have many other behavioral disorders that you need to know. Since knowledge is power, you will figure out how to protect yourself once you spot narcissists' red flags. Considering the instability of narcissists' emotions and hot tempers, you must know the do's and don'ts when dealing with them. Here are 10 mistakes that will get you into trouble with a narcissist. Number 1. Calling narcissists out for their unpleasant behaviors. Narcissists do not want to hear negative feedback about their behaviors because they are only after other people's praise, favor, and applause. They will justify their actions to make it sound like you are the bad guy because you are judging them. There is nothing wrong with calling other people out for their unpleasant behaviors because it is another way of showing concern for them. However, if you call out close-minded people like narcissists, you will only get into trouble with them. These people have their share of standards of what is right and wrong. The problem is that narcissists think they're always right since they create a delusional sense of self-perfection, which means they can't go wrong. Number 2. Trying to correct and discipline narcissists. Since narcissists think they are perfect, they will never accept correction and discipline. Correcting and disciplining other people for their unreasonable behavior is not wrong. However, you should know that hard-headed people like narcissists will never listen to anyone's sermon. Narcissists will only prove that they are right and you are wrong. If you try to correct and discipline them, you will get into trouble because they will resist disciplinary action and you will end up feeling drained because narcissists will never listen to you as they are not open to criticism, even constructive ones. Number 3. Responding to narcissists' attention-seeking behaviors Narcissists want to get your attention because they are attention seekers. Their attention-seeking behaviors range from trying to make a show to performing dangerous acts, annoying others, and the like. Since narcissists are self-centered, they want to be in the spotlight. Narcissists strive to get other people's eyes and ears directed toward them. In addition, narcissists are thirsty for others' praise as it will boost their inflated egos even more. Indeed, narcissists live for the applause. You might get into trouble if you respond to narcissists' attention-seeking behaviors since these people have unstable emotions and quick tempers. You will endanger your safety if you piss them off. Never feed narcissists' cravings for attention because they will feel euphoric once they get it. And you contribute to boosting their inflated egos if you respond to their attention-seeking behaviors. Number 4. Participating in an unhealthy exchange of words with narcissists. Narcissists are always up for argument or debate because they are loud and proud. Since they think they're always right, they have the urge to argue with anyone who disagrees with their opinions. Never get involved in an unhealthy exchange of words with narcissists because you will only waste your time and energy on their nonsense talks. You will never learn something if you get into a debate with those egomaniacs. This is because their only mission is to prove they are correct when it is obvious that they are wrong. Narcissists will squirm in anger if you expose inaccuracies in their claims. Number 5. Showing narcissists that you have weak boundaries. Vulnerable victims attract narcissistic people to enter their lives. Never show narcissists that you are too welcoming because they are intruders. They will break in and steal whatever narcissistic supply they find in you. Thus, you must learn to set healthy boundaries to prevent narcissists from trespassing into your private space. Those egomaniacs will only bring confusion, destruction, and trauma if you allow them to enter your life. Avoid getting yourself into trouble with narcissists by building firm and tall walls between you and them. Because that way, it will be hard for those intruders to climb over those walls. As a result, narcissists will eventually get tired of trying to infiltrate your private life. Narcissists love an easy job, which is why they search for an easy target. Do not put your guard down every time you deal with narcissists because they are only waiting for the perfect time to strike on you. Show those egomaniacs that you are not the potential victim to pursue. Number 6. Conforming to Narcissists' Gaslighting Tactics 
Narcissists deploy gaslighting tactics to plant doubt in your mind. They will invalidate your thoughts and emotions by making you believe that you are only making things up. If you conform to narcissists' gaslighting tactics, you will eventually get into trouble with them. You will think you might be going crazy since those egomaniacs constantly deny your reality. In addition, you may feel like there is a reduction in your worth as a person because narcissists will devalue you through their gaslighting tactics. Strengthening your core identity is one of the most powerful weapons to destroy narcissists' gaslighting tactics. If you have successfully built a strong core identity, narcissists can't use your flaws and weaknesses to put you down. If you know yourself well enough, there is no reason for you to be affected by the narcissist's offensive words against you. To be more familiar with yourself, you should perform constant introspection, a process of examining one's thoughts and feelings. Discover yourself and embrace every part of you that others fail to acknowledge and appreciate. Number 7. Showing too much emotion in front of narcissists Since narcissists are attention seekers, they want your reaction and emotions. You might get into trouble if you show too much emotion in front of them. If you are too transparent to them, they might be able to discover your weaknesses and use them against you. You must learn how to maintain a poker face when dealing with narcissists' attention-seeking behaviors. Suppose they observe that you are unresponsive and unaffected by their tactics. In that case, narcissists will eventually get exhausted and disengage from you to look for another victim. Number 8. Justifying Narcissists' Red Flags Suppose you have someone special who is narcissistic, perhaps a close friend, a romantic partner, family member, colleague, boss, etc. In that case, you should not turn a blind eye to the red flags they display in front of you or others. Do not allow your love and concern for them to overshadow all those red flags. You might get into trouble if you justify narcissists' flaws and mistakes. Those egomaniacs will think that you are tolerating them and their unpleasant behaviors. As a result, narcissists will never change for the better because they know someone is already ready to defend and justify their actions. You might only want to be understanding towards narcissistic people. However, narcissists will take advantage of you for always considering and pardoning their faults. Number 9. Believing in Narcissists' Promises Narcissists are expert liars and great pretenders. They have excellent acting skills to make you believe they are being truthful to you. However, do not fall for their filtered charm, charisma, and fancy words because they do not know how to fulfill their word of honor. It is easy for narcissists to make a promise. The challenging part is they do not know how to keep it. They will only give you false hopes and you will only get into trouble if you put your trust in them. Narcissists only prove the old saying, promises are made to be broken. Number 10. Settling down with a narcissist It is like surrendering and putting yourself in jail if you settle down with a narcissist. You do not have something to look forward to except life imprisonment. If you commit yourself to a narcissistic partner, they will isolate you in their delusional world with no way out. They tend to be overprotective and possessive of you, as if they own your life. You will get into trouble if you settle down with those egomaniacs because they will only control and ruin your life. Have you experienced doing something that had gotten you into danger at the hands of narcissists? If so, what did you do that triggered them to attack you? Now that you already know the do's and don'ts when dealing with those egomaniacs, you should be able to build immunity against narcissistic attacks. Did you find this video interesting? What do you think? Leave a comment below. Like this video and subscribe to this channel. Watch this next video right here.